We walked into, into the meeting and we had our banners on which said climate emergency um, and we went in very dignified, very calmly. Um, we also had banners that said climate emergency and we wanted to, to put our speech across um, to get the, the Treasury to actually start investing into greener energies and, and putting that as a priority rather than investing in fossil fuels we are in this climate emergency um, so we went in uh, to deliver this message in a peaceful manner uh, and it didn't end up in, in the manner that we, we wished it to. Well uh, as I say we, we quite clearly had our message across us you know climate emergency that is what we were there for uh, and we, we stated and I, I stated as well when I was getting manhandled out that it's a peaceful protest um, so there was like over 300 people in, the, in that room at the time and there was only one that reacted in that way. Um, so I think that we, you know, we, we had that message, we had the climate emergency and I think it was quite obvious that we were there for that reason, for a peaceful protest and we weren't armed. I was armed with peer-reviewed peer science you know, the message we were giving out, that's all I was armed with. I don't intend to press charges. Um, I haven't had an apology for it from him. Um, my priority is the planet and the future of it, and you know that that's what I'm focusing on. The the Tory government can sort out their own staff and discipline him as they see fit. I'm not going to prosecute. I feel very tired this morning. Um, I was shaken up after it happened, and I wasn't expecting that kind of reaction. I was expecting a conversation, a dialogue with people. Um, but I certainly didn't expect that, but I'm, I'm fine, thank you.